Welcome to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, share, and turn your post notifications so you'll know when I post. I can see how Hi, my name is Adrian, and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today's video will be my top 10 favorite apps. I'll tell you what the app, the name of the app, what the app does, and I'll also show you a screenshot so you can download it for yourself. Okay, the first app is called Silo, S-Y-L-O, and it's basically an app for your music. You can um, combine your SoundCloud, Apple Music, Spotify, and YouTube all into one app. And I really liked this app before I got um, Apple Music because I can get like SoundCloud and Spotify and still listen to it on my phone. I didn't have to download it, then put it into iTunes, and then put it on um, Apple Music. Next app is Play on Cloud. Now this app I use for my phone and for my um, Roku TV. This app is basically you can download from like HBO, Netflix, Amazon Video, YouTube, videos that you'll want to watch again so you don't have to keep going to those apps and finding the video. Or like Netflix when they take off the movies you can still have it. So what you do is you go in the app and you um, search for whichever TV show or movie you're looking for. Then you hit download and it'll save it to the cloud and you can also watch it on your TV. The next app I have is of course YouTube. I don't really have to tell you much about that because you're watching me on it right now. Um, the next one is Documents by Riddle or Riddle. And basically I use this app for um, videos I can't find on Play on Cloud. And it's basically you just get YouTube video links and download the um, the YouTube video so you can watch it again. The next one is Shoebox. This one is a photo um, app. You use this one to like save all of your photos from your iPhone, your camera, your um, MacBook, stuff like that. Like I can go back years and years. Like I have pictures in there from 2014 like so I don't I don't take up space on my iPhone I just save them into shoebox the next one is Castbox. now this is a um, podcast app I've really been getting into podcasts lately like business podcasts um, because I'm trying to start my own business well I already started my own business but trying to get better at owning my own business so this app I listen to different podcasts on there I listen to um funny podcast, any kind of podcast. So if you have any suggestions, just leave those down below. The next app I don't think is available anymore is Go90, but I'm pretty sure they shut down, but it was an app where you could watch TV shows and movies and things on there. My favorite ones were like Tagged, and it was the Neville, but I can't think of the name of it right now, but I think they're no longer have that app anymore. The next one is TV Time. This one is for like the premiere dates of TV shows and we're well, not movies, TV shows. And they'll tell you, like give you a reminder, like this show is starting in an hour. This show will be back in two weeks, something like that. Like I like this one because I can't remember when TV shows are coming on. So I just have this app and it'll send me notifications to let me know what time is coming on. And like it'll tell you the, net, the um, brief description of what the episode will be about. The next one is Spark. This app was also made by the same people that made the Documents app. I like Spark because I have multiple um, email addresses. So I like that they're all in one place and I don't have to go from here to there. Like I have a Yahoo and I have about six Gmail. So I like that it's all in one place and it also has like a calendar. It has different things inside of Spark. That's why I like to use Spark instead of the regular Gmail or the mail account that comes on the iPhone. 
And the last app is Planner Pro. Now I like this app because I have horrible memory. If I don't write it down or tell somebody to remind me, I will never get it done. I just, I can't remember anything. So Planner Pro is really good because I write like YouTube video ideas when I want to film them. Um, appointments I have, meetings I have to be at. So I really like to use Planner Pro for that. And you can color coordinate it. You can um, put it on different devices so it can always be with you all the time. So I really like that app. And I think all 10 of these apps, you should really go to the App Store or Google Play and download them. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.